week after week, the reported recap gives us a chance to show off your photos and videos, to show off some of the sights and sounds from around the state, the beauty, the fun, the unusual things that might not otherwise find a place in a newscast. But news is in our name. And reported videos like this one help us tell your stories. Vandals hit the Noel family's pool in Shelton. People get joy out of creating this kind of havoc. Um, I, I just, I don't understand it personally. And after our story aired, the Namco Pool Company offered to come out and fix or replace their pool at no charge. The Meriden Housing Authority is going to do something about a mouse problem after a News 8 story earlier this week. People who live in this complex use Report It to let us know about it. They don't hide. They'll come out and be all up on your stove trying to be in your pots and pans while you're cooking. It's a bear wandering around Torrington. Brandon got some video, Christine and Danielle got pictures. There's presumably another bear looking for a meal in Madison and Guilford. A truck crashed on 84 Monday near exit 11. Ken and Karen sent us pictures. And there were a couple of crashes that made headlines Tuesday. One on 91 in Meriden involving a state trooper. The other on 95 in Bridgeport involving a truck and a pretty big backup. Your pictures again helped us tell the story. Also Tuesday, Andrew, Craig, Jennifer, Kelly, and Michael sent us shots of a pretty serious car fire in Hamden. But we'll wrap it up this week with some of the amazing sights from last weekend's Opsell event in southeastern Connecticut. That video from Margie and pictures from Deline, Bob, and Steve put us right on the pier. But these fireworks photos from Bill Shettle are some of the most breathtaking we've ever seen. Wow. I'm Chris Velarde, News 8.